Pokemon Legends EA will be the end of Pokemon. Here's why. Are you ready? Good. Let's get some buckets. Here are five things that's gonna make this game a bunch of hot garbage. Number one, the shiny noise. Pokemon Legends Arceus gave us a side mission called a Peculiar Ponyta, which gave you a free shiny pretty early in the game. To make matters better, Pokemon gave us this noise when a shiny was around. The feeling that goes into that noise just has you like... We can all agree when you heard that noise, there was a sense of accomplishment. Until the year 2022 hit, we got Pokemon Scarlet and Violet, but no noise? So what happened? Pokemon saw that we had it too good, so they decided to take our happiness out of the equation and put it into useless junk, like Pokemon Go, Pokemon Unite, and the Pokemon Trading Card Game. So we get these awful updates on Pokemon games nobody cares about, only to never hear the most beautiful noise again. You might be right about that, little Johnny. However, what the heck is this? What's up, brother? Basically, this was a major fail by Pokemon, and they wanted us to have this sensation instead. Number two, crafting materials. Since the story takes place in the past, you got the chance to craft your own materials. We got some new info on what the mechanics may look like in the new trailer. But Richie, are they true? But of course they what? Dear Richie, the game is inspired heavily by Pokemon Coliseum, unlike Legends Arceus. Oh, hell no. Then what is the point of the title? And why Coliseum? That game is a bunch of dog water. Y'all hype it up like it's the peak of Pokemon. The characters are bogus, it's fake-ass Jordans, and this one stays shopping at Journeys. So this is peak Pokemon? Dear Richie, no wild mons, no catching mechanics. Okay, bruh. Who's writing this junk? You're excluding wild Pokemon, you're excluding no catchy mechanics, and not only that, you took the best protagonist that Pokemon ever had- Let's just take a deep breath. Why y'all looking at me like- Number three, no space-time distortions. Pokemon Legends Arceus put space-time distortions in all five areas, and Pokemon that you can only get in space-time distortions. But have they cut this out of the new game entirely? Of course they have. Where are you going to put them? You're in the city for the whole game surrounded by people, and you're gonna just drop a space-time distortion with a bunch of ruthless killers? Like, I don't know how you go about- Who is- who's calling me? Hello? Number 4, Legendary Forms. Legendary Forms are very in right now, and we can expect some new ones in this new game. Right? Pokemon Legends Arceus gave us Dialga and Palkia origin forms, but then they also gave us a new Forces of Nature in Enamorous, which... But then we got Paradox Pokemon, and let me tell you, these were the worst abominations that you could put in this game. Can you really consider them legendaries? Compared to Dialga and Palkia, their base stat totals are completely lopsided. And then you mean to tell me, walking weight, the ancestor to Suicune is only 20 points higher than a freaking iron bundle? How? It just doesn't make any sense to me how a legendary Pokemon is nerfed from the original. So do us all a favor here, Pokemon. Do not do Xerneas and Yavatal dirty. They don't deserve that. The last thing is what had Pokemon fans playing the game longer, and that's massive mass outbreaks. This was another way to shiny hunt your Pokemon since you can not only get the Pokemon that you want, but you can also get better odds of getting that shiny. If nothing else, Pokemon, just add this to the game. You can make up some story saying like, Oh yeah, we just had a lab experiment and all the Pokemon escaped from the lab and all this other stuff. Oh yeah, go Pokemon. You can do that! Charizard outbreak or a Blaziken outbreak. And don't even get me started if these are Megas in these outbreaks because you already know what time it is then. Well, if it's in the game. You are gonna put it in the game, right? These things will be the end of Pokemon, but let me know your thoughts on what you want to see in the new game. As always, if you guys enjoy, make sure to crush that subscribe button, sand barrier that shit, and you already know, join the hidden sand village. Leave a like down below if you enjoyed this video, and as my lord and savior says, y'all stay like a lamb, and I'll see y'all in the next video. That's all, folks.